Jackson Carter. Fancy meeting you here. Walter. Now, if you don't mind, I'd really like to be going. Always a pleasure, Professor Carter. Dr. Andrews, to what do I owe the pleasure? I thought you'd still be in Russia. I've decided to cut my trip short. I wanted to come see you right away. Is everything all right? Oh, it's more than all right. This is something that we have been looking forward to for many years. I'm sorry, I guess this is the day for unexpected visitors. Sorry, Professor, I didn't mean to interrupt. Dave, this is Dr. Lawrence Andrews. Oh, it's a pleasure to meet you, sir. Oh, likewise. Dave is my teaching assistant at the university. He's in our grad program. Ah. Oh, Professor, you told me to come by to pick up that book on Egypt oh. I need for class tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, it's a third shelf from the top in the, in the middle somewhere. So what's happened? Jackson, I found something in Moscow. I was going through the original diaries of Nicholas Rorich, and hidden inside his original manuscript for his Heart of Asia book, I found this note. There in its cave shall the stone rest until the appointed time and the prophecy shall be fulfilled. What, what prophecies? The treasure is returning from the east. On the mountains the fires of jubilation are kindled. There walk those who carry the stone. Out of the sacred kingdom is given the date when the carpet of expectations may be spread. By the signs of the seven stars shall the gates be opened. The Sintamani Stone. The, the what? Lawrence, this is it! The Sintamani Stone is a legendary Buddhist artifact. A stone that was said to grant wishes. Yes, roughly translated, Sintamani means wish jewel. Supposedly it had the power to create anything you could ever think of, if you believed in that sort of thing. Here, some Buddhists believe that the Sintamani stone is one of four relics that fell from the sky in 331 AD, introducing the Buddhist teachings to the Tibetan people. What does the stone have to do with Nicholas, what's his name? Rorich, Nicholas Rorich. He was a Russian artist and a writer who toured Asia in the 1920s in search of a mystical kingdom called Shambhala, a Buddhist pure land. Shambhala is said to be the final resting place of the Sintamani stone. Some historians think that Rorich might have actually found this Shambhala, thus finding the Sintamani stone. 
This is Rorich. He was obsessed with finding Shambhala, and even included this into my stone in some of his paintings. But there was never any proof that he actually found it. Until now. Yeah, but we still don't know where. Well, we know it's in a cave, probably outside Shigatsi in Tibet, if the legends are true. Who is that? Dave! What? Oh, what? What? I've lost him. That man has been following me since I returned from Russia, and I fear that word about the note has already gotten out. Well, if they didn't know, they will now once that guy gets back to whoever he's working for. Jackson, you've got to go after this thing. We cannot risk the power of the stone getting into the hands of some people who could abuse it. Lawrence, you know I don't believe in mystical religious powers. I just believe in what I can see in front of me. The Sintamani Stone. Jackson, think of it. Believe me, I have. Dave, pack your stuff. What? You're coming with me. We don't even know where it is. Not exactly, but I have a place to start and that's enough. Welcome to Shanghai, Dave. It's great, Professor. But why are we here? I know a guy who's got lots of contacts in China. I'm hoping he'll know somebody in Shigatsi who can help us find a stone. Great. Place looks empty, Ray. Jackson! So good to see you. You know my business is always a little slow during the day. Ray, this is David Roberts. He's one of my students. Dave, this is Raymond Howard. You're American. No matter how hard I try, I've been out here a little while. I find the clientele more to my liking. Actually, they won't let him back in the States. <laughs> Where did you hear such lies? I would never do anything illegal of a questionable nature. Right, right. Uh, what if I could pay you this time? So good to see you. How can I help you? Well... I need to know if you have any good contacts in Tibet, specifically Shigatsi. Well, that depends on what you're looking for, of course. We found proof that the Sintamani stone was hidden by Nicholas Rorich on his eastern tour in the 1920s. Rumors always been that he last had it at Shigatsi. Sintamani stone? Never heard of it. Well, you're not a very religious kind of guy, are you? You insult me, Mr. Carter. I have some very strong beliefs. I often commune with spirits. <laughs> <laughs> Drunk. I am not. Guys, can we get back on topic here, please? I have someone who might be able to help you. He lives with some Buddhist monks in Tibet. I don't know if he'll know about your stone, but he's the best I've got. His name is Yeshe. He lives at the Tasilunpo Monastery in Shigatse. But he's not a monk? Well, not technically. With his past, I don't know if they'd let him officially join, but we had some good times back in the day. What was that? I think somebody's about to crash our party. May I help you, gentlemen? I don't think they speak English, Ray. Professor Kata, please come with us. Pleasant surprise. What do we do now? Improvise. Not again. Get 
Hey, grab our stuff. Ray, I'm sorry about the mess. I'd make this up to you, I promise. Yeah, just like you did last time. <sighs> Jerk. Now what? Now we gotta find a way to Tibet. They told me you were back here. Who are you? What do you want? My name is Jackson Carter. Raymond Howard told me you might be able to help me. Ray? How's the old man these days? I still can't seem to keep out of trouble. <laughs> right. Ray wouldn't just send anybody to me. What are you looking for? The Sintamani Stone. Come. The Sintamani Stone will not give you what you seek. What are we seeking? You're not the first to seek the stone, and you won't be the last. The stone has a power you do not understand. Look, I'm not looking for the stone for power or some personal gain. I just want to know the truth. I want to know that it's real. was once part of the expedition with Nicholas Rorich. When I was a boy, before he died, he told me all about their troubles. And he gave me this. Your father made a map? Yes. But why trust us with it? You said there had been others. Sometimes it is hard to explain what you just know. This will take you where you want to go. Indeed it will. Walter Kane, what a surprise. I see you've been following Andrew since Russia. Very clever, Carter. I knew you'd figure it out, as did Andrews, obviously. I can't believe I've been a step ahead of you this whole time. Oh, ahead? Maybe not so clever. Time to go. Shamar. Many thanks for this, my good sir. Mr. Carter, it would do you well if you remember my warning.
Carter. You and the kid. Professor, what do we do? Well, this into Monty Stone is a sacred Buddhist artifact. It's a Monty Stone, so we should probably show it the proper respect. Om Mane Padme Hum. 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 Give me the stone. Do you think we should go in and get it? Do you really think it would let us? Mom, let's go home. <laughs>